Possum Strain Smith here in Alpha Craft. And it's still a little croaky, so you'll have to excuse me, but I am getting better every day. So what are we doing here and what is this strange contraption? <laughs> well, I am tired of every time I come up from my mine not being sure if there's a horde of pillagers waiting for me or some creepers that haven't despawned because I've got my little clock so that's okay I can see if um if it's day or night but I can't see what's waiting so we're going to build a building around our mine shafts today now these two because they're the deepest they're getting something a little special they're going to get a head frame over them and you'll see what that is uh, these we can just go up and down so we'll start with now I know this is acacia and it's wood but you just have to imagine that it's um, iron or steel and painted red Probably for rust protection, I imagine. Not sure. Okay, so that's that's the start of the base of the head frame. And that's the start of supports for the whole thing. And again, you have to imagine that that's red painted metal, not acacia wood. Okay. Now, it's fine to have this, but it's still open, isn't it? So we're going to build a little building around it. Well, not so little a building, but there will be a building. Now, um, how do I want to do this? Where does it come? Uh, now, this is based loosely and I mean loosely, on the Rontha Valley Heritage Centre in Wales. Uh, do I want to do that? Do I want to do this? Now, the Rontha Valley Heritage Centre, it used to be a working mine. Now it's... Um, a place where people can go and see the history of mining. Um, mining played a huge part in Wales, like it played a huge part in Cornwall. Although in Cornwall it was largely tin, in Wales it was largely coal. Yeah, I want this front bit to be brick. This is not going to be the most attractive of builds, but that is not the point. And where it goes over the ravine, we will deal with that. Now, where is it? Uh, there. Okay, we'll bring... Uh, this can go here. And guess what? I'm doing a build that's not symmetrical. <gasps> Shark! <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that will do. Okay. Now, I'm not too stressed about this part. At work. There we go. That's the basic shape, I think. And we'll have a wooden structure that comes out here. So we may as well... Oh, do I put that in in this? I actually think we might do this bit in a mixture of, I don't know, cobble and spruce or something. Yes, this building's going to be a bit of a mishmash. But what we do now... Is we really start mishing and mashing so uh, one two three 
four, five. I think so. Now I'm going to build this up. There we go. Now some of this is going to be quite dull, so I think the best way for us to do it might be in the form of a time lapse. And I'll come back to bits and pieces as they become more interesting. Yeah, that may well be the way to do it. Okay. So, um, I'm going to need stairs for there. I'm going to need lots of stairs, actually. I didn't realise. Oh, I want a circular saw that works like the stone cutter. I really, really do. And I'll bring the scaffolding up as we go up. So I'll go get some stairs and then we will start time lapsing. Oh, I should have said this cage thing down here. <clears throat> That's the lift cage. I'll just have a quick look. So the miners can get up and down. I mean, it's a conceit, isn't it? Because we'll be using that and that. But, uh, and for anyone who knows anything about mines, it probably doesn't look anything like it should. Just allow me my, um, allow me my imagination. That's the main structure of the head frame done. We've got to do the big wheel next and support some brackets for it. Um, I've just got to get some more resources together. Uh, I'll 
see you back here. Yeah. And I love scaffolding. See you shortly. And there we go. That's all the um, supports in. And I've got bracing. And I managed to do it without dying. I've still only got the one death since we started the death counter. I've got a few more deaths than that, as we know. Um, that one death was to a group of pillagers who broke all my armour and then broke me. <laughs> and you'll have to excuse the dirt there. The next bit's a little tricky. I don't particularly want to plummet to my doom. So I've put in some dirt. Let's um, just put in a bit of light. That seems like a good idea. Okay, let's get up there and let's make a great big winding wheel. Okay, now I've got pressure plates here for mob proofing. I'll have to do the same there, although I might just light it. I don't know. I'll have a think. Uh, I think we do this. Okay, well, that's going to happen. Now I'm going to make the wheel out of andesite wall. So I've got to remember that's facing forwards. All right, that's going to be a little tricky. One, two, three. going to have two large wheels so that's the first spar of the first one. I really don't want you doing that. So let's get the second spar done. It's two, three, four, five, six, and I don't have feather falling. So, I mean, that's not going to kill me, I don't think, but it's still going to hurt. And that's going to annoy me. Shall we try again? That's better. Two, six, and a gap of one. Hooray. If the rope has to go out that way, which it does, this comes down five. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four. Five. And it goes across four, one, two, three, and that one's four. There we go. Oh, time for bed. Back in a tick. Now that comes down one. And then a cross one. And that comes down two. And a cross one. And down two. Down one and out two, so it should join up with that. Yes, it does. And then across.
across one, two, three, one, two, three, and let's have a look at that. It's not right. Why isn't it right? Because that's only down four. That is down five. That's out too. Oh, I'm looking at this backwards. No, I've got this drawn up and I'm looking at it backwards. So that's out too. This is out three. Oh, I'm so glad I put all the dirt in now. That's over two. Oh, I really made a mess of this, didn't I? That's a gap of two. What have I done wrong? Oh, I have made a very simple mistake. This is in the wrong space, which is throwing everything out by one. If I get this right, everything else is fine. That was like pulling teeth, wasn't it? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go do the other quarter, then we can do the top halves. Yay. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. One to join it here. Oh, this is working much better. Nothing like knowing what you're doing. Now, uh, two down. Yes! Ha ha! Sleepy Bobos, and then we'll get the top half done. Now, <laughs> I think I just did the easy bit. Now it gets hard. All right, let's see if we can not make a mess of this. So, um, two up, one in. Two up, two in, uh, and then two on top, one more in, one on top. And this should be five across, in count, including this one. One, two, three should be right over the axle, which it is. Four, five. Right. Now we've got to get down. Ah. Uh. Oh, that was a little bit nerve-wracking. Okay. That's our arc done. Now. Um, one. And then two. And one on top. And one underneath. 
and that should be that quarter done. Is this giving me the heebies? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. Now for the front. Two on top. Another two, I think. That comes out. I don't know where that just went. That goes in. And this comes out one, two. Trust me, I look like I know what I'm doing. Ha ha. There we go, one whole wheel. Now I've just got to build the other one. And the head frame's done. There's still more to do, but the head frame's done. There we go. One head frame with wheel. You can see the ropes going down to pull up the um, lift for the miners. There's going to be more ropes coming off there that come down at this angle into an engine shed which I will build there. But wow that was a big task and <clears throat> I think that's all my voice is going to take for today. So. That's it. Um, I know it's a bit odd. I'm doing an industrial build this time. There's going to be quite a few industrial buildings here. It is going over a mine. I'm leaving that scaffolding there until I sort out the lighting up there. But that's it. So the head frame and I are going to say, you know what to do. If you've liked this, whack the like button. It does help things. Subscribe if you haven't, hit the notification bell and select all. Otherwise YouTube won't tell you when the videos come in. And I'll see you next time. Bye.